cutest thing I've ever seen. What the heck? They have a little market in here. Espresso bar is beautiful and I'm so excited. What the heck even is this? I'm getting it and I can't wait. So we have the Maka Warrior Mocha right here and I'm very excited to not spill it on myself because I'm not paying attention, but. That's actually really good. You can taste a little bit of the protein powder in it, but it still just tastes like an ice latte, so. Nice. and the meatballs and then we have the enchiladas they're so colorful this is probably one of the best dishes i've had especially with spaghetti squash um, or any kind of like not spiralized but just any kind of non-pasta noodle um, it has a really great great flavor and the pesto is made with pumpkin seeds which is really exciting and the meatballs are super nutty and you have that little mushroom flavor to it too so i am happy with this how are you feeling this is delicious. <laughs> really delicious. So I'm glad you like it. All right, let's try this. <laughs> yes, maybe. It's pomegranate. to the travel vlogs, right? That's there a good idea. Go. Phoenix about to go eat at the vegan house which is gonna be like an Asian food lots of mock meats that kind of thing uh, but later we're gonna go to downtown Tempe to just walk around and see the little shops and stuff and maybe we'll find a vegan place I don't know but we'll see So at every Thai restaurant I go to, I always get the Thai tea with boba if they have it, but I decided I'd get a little crazy today and do the Thai coffee with boba, and it's delicious. They did not go easy on the boba, and that's fantastic, and it's, it's fantastic. I think this is my new drink, so. So right here we have the pumpkin curry with the seafood and then the green curry with the soy chicken and then the rice and we're all just gonna share these and eat them together. See how they are taste. You, yes, are you guys excited? <laughs> I'm excited. Are you excited to have me? I am so excited. <laughs> so we have coconut ice cream with fried banana that they generously gave to us and then we also Strawberry have... Dessert. Ooh, yum. Yum. And then we also have purple rice with mango and then that coconut sauce on top it's like that sweet mango sticky rice that you usually get and the rice they said was a lot healthier than white rice so yeah let's see yeah. The taste mm. first wow. bite shot mm. it's good mm -hmm. is that one good yeah it's like, <laughs> wow so how does this ice cream compare to like regular ice cream that you're used to that's very good it's not yeah. as creamy but right it's very good right Tasty. This is really good and it's not too sweet either. 
and for some people that may be an issue but for me I definitely am not a fan of like super sweet stuff but it's very good. So I don't know if I've shared with you guys my love for random bathroom stuff but this bathroom is so cute. I'm gonna get a different shot in a second but oh my goodness. So what are we what are we about to ingest here? Yeah, some <laughs> beautiful lentil loving salad. <laughs> um, and a tapatio, paprika. Yeah, okay. rice pilaf. Okay. And, and you said how is everything made? In the house from scratch. scratch. Nice. <laughs> Local, okay. Try to be nice. weirdness and love. And love. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> So, so far what I really like about this place is that the food is very fresh tasting. It also looks very fresh, but also the whole space is super intimate and the kitchen was right there as you guys saw. So I'm, I'm really digging it. 